Hey guys, welcome back to Do It On A Dime with Catherine. I am so excited for today's video. We are cleaning, organizing, and getting ready for back to school. Owen wave. <laughs> These are practical and realistic decluttering solutions for anybody, and I mean anybody. And don't forget to stick around to the end because I think it's my favorite part. 2021 has been a year for me to get back to my best physical and emotional health, which is why I am so grateful to be able to partner with Life Cuisine. Right now, I'm really focused on choosing food that helps me thrive and feel good getting ready for this school year. It makes such a difference for me, and that can be hard to do. With Life Cuisine, I know lunch is one part of my day that will be delicious, fulfilling, and easy. Their new Meat Lovers Zoodles Bowl fits my low-carb lifestyle. It is gluten-free, has just 12 grams of net carbs and 17 grams of protein, and it's made with spiralized zucchini, Italian sausage, and pepperoni. It is brand new this year and I'm so excited I get to share it with you. I'm feeling ready and I cannot wait to tackle this, so let's jump into it. On Instagram, I asked what were the pain points in your home right now and almost everybody said the kitchen, especially the little items that end up there and the paperwork. Oh, the paperwork. Ours had gotten totally out of control. It was almost like a never ending clown car of stuff, including our art wall. And this is the year we do a reset. I like to call this the highlight clear. It's worked for us for years. Let me explain. If your kids don't yet have a memory box, I highly suggest getting a weather tight file box. These are really inexpensive and some hanging folders. You can put this together in about five minutes. And this is the way we keep track of all of those papers we want to save. Everybody's got their bins. Owen, this is for all your stuff. And Carson, this is for all your stuff. And we're just saving the really important things, the things you really love to remember later. If everything's important, then nothing's important. So we pick just a couple of items that really highlight what that year was all about, stick them in a file folder, and then we have a memory box that's realistic to enjoy. And our countertops will definitely thank us. Our schoolroom gets a reset, so it's ready for the new year. I love that these can so easily store into the kids' closets. The days can be long, but the years are short. I just love these boxes. Something else in the kitchen, especially right now, are your technology stations where you charge things. So ours had gotten really out of control with all of the cords and wires, so we did a declutter. Think about how many times you've accessed cords you need to save, very little. We only wanted to keep the things out that we use every single day. And I put all of their technology right in dollar store napkin holders. For the extras that we sometimes need to access, I got dollar store boxes and put this in a shoe box hidden away so it wasn't cluttering up a system that we have to use all the time. If you struggle with paperwork and calendars, I have got you covered. This side of our fridge is our drop zone for school. Here we have all of our classroom handbooks in this little folder, PTO information, so it's at the ready anytime we need it. And if family calendars have failed for you in the past, what I love about this one is it's divided up by person. You can find this on my blog. I'll be sure to link it down below. You just tape the calendar together, put a little hole punch in the top. We've used this for so many years and it keeps us from compartmentalizing what's going on during the week. And I wanna take you over to this other wall, so follow me. This is our drop zone for the kids' supplies. I got this on clearance for all of the kids' schoolwork that they need to take so it doesn't end up on the main counter. It's not perfect, our house gets messy, but it helps it a lot to stay more organized. Did you need the kitchen to look good still, or? <laughs> 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 no, they don't care. Plus there's all that mess on the table. <laughs> oh yeah. 
this time of year, I also love to make sure I have a neat and tidy lunch zone so the kids can help make their lunches. And there's a couple of awesome products I wanna show you. I love silicone containers. These are expandable so you can fit many of them in a drawer. And I also love these upright zip seal silicone containers. They're perfect for fruits and vegetables. They are microwave and dishwasher safe. And then I can stick all of this inside a drawer so the kids can help pack their lunches. Seriously, if you haven't tried those zip containers, you need to, I'll link them below. I am really into labeling kids stuff and you can buy custom labels online for just a couple of dollars or make your own if you have a vinyl decal cutter. Just make sure that they're the permanent kind that you can run through the dishwasher. These water bottles were just a few dollars from the dollar section. I love how they turned out and they are not going to go missing. At least we can cross our fingers. I love those easy declutters that take just a couple of minutes but have a really big impact. I love this one. You've got to try this the night before the first day of school. My friend Susanna does this with her kids and it became a tradition in our house to get mini $1 frames and write down four words that you want your kids to leave the house with as they go to school this year. Are <laughs> they're, Yeah, they're little eyeballs. Can I try one? <laughs> yeah. Take some frozen yogurt and let them sprinkle those things on top. Yes. Curiosity. Joy. That one's joy. I think this one should be joy too. To be excited about things, right, next year. And what's that one? Kindness. Kindness. Chocolate is kindness. The school Sunday is such a simple way to connect with your kids and share with them the gifts you would love to see them take into the new year. You guys have got this. I love curiosity. I love curiosity. If you enjoyed this video, would you leave it a big thumbs up? That really helps me out a lot. If nobody has told you today, you are enough. And I am so glad you're here. Be sure to subscribe because I want to catch you guys in the next one. I'll see you there. Bye. <laughs> oh, daddy's getting in on the action. It's shame to have any of this go to waste. Get all of the eyeballs. Oh, get some eyeballs. <laughs>